Thank fucking shit. Here we are, one day later. Finally beat these goddamn bastards. It's the big fuckwad in the American t-shirt that gave me the most trouble. He's why I'm recording this one day later. Because he's the one who kept beating me. Finally got frustrated, quit, and killed his ass. Hmm? Yeah, 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 all this shit. Well, when I killed him, I figured out I did find the guy I was looking for. I don't even know what day he shows up on, so I'm like, yay! I'm gonna go grab a food here. Let me grab this pineapple. You'll know why later. Come on, bitches, I didn't spend a good half hour trying to beat you in poker. Funny when you kill the two, when you kill when I killed uh, the fat guy in the American flag T-shirt. His buddy came over there and tried fighting me. Then I killed his ass. Then I went to the girl, talked to her. She's like, "You monster!" I'm like, "Ha ha ha!" Then I killed her. Killed another survivor because I was frustrated. It's like four, as you can see. No, more like five. Okay. There's a whole lot of fucking survivors I gotta save, and I'm only really gonna record for half an hour. So. Is that how long I recorded last night? Half an hour. A little over half an hour. But... <sighs> so I'll technically be uploading or recording for three days in a row. Uh, why even waste my guns on those fuckers? Worst mission <laughs> in the whole game. I have barely a clue what the fuck to do. Rhyme didn't know it, okay. He's not there yet, but he, he'll show up eventually. Of course, Taper to Die shows up, so... And that one guy, yeah, yeah, I gotta go get him. He spawns at four. Right over there, get him, then probably come back, save another survivor. It's gonna be a busy half hour. Taper to die shows up at seven. <sighs> Damn, that was frustrating. Almost didn't make it. Come on, slut. Don't waste my time, seriously. I was seriously thinking about adding a little extra to the very end of my let's play. Just come back, record me killing these bastards just for the fun of it. Too bad they took out zombified survivors, so. That was always fun. But then I'd have to save them again. Wouldn't it be easier if I just gave them like $100,000 each? Because I could, so... Of course, I was watching my Zombrex uh, bar slowly tick down like... Nye. And I got two missions, of course. Unlike in Dead Rising one, 2, for some odd reason, I couldn't... And 2, I remember you could actually accept missions and... You could pick up the collar thing and accept the mission. You could also check the time, I think. For some reason won't let me do that. I guess they didn't completely... I don't know why they took that out. They probably just didn't remember to put it back in. And luckily I did stop then, because I had the explosive shits. <laughs> they get a whole bunch of false alarms lately, so... Never can be too careful. Never can be. Wow, thanks. Yeah, thanks for wasting my time, asshole. And I don't get shit. Kitty. You're a pain in the ass. Pain in the royal ass. Now I'm gonna go save that hidden survivor I missed. He's hard. To, he's pretty easy to miss. That's. Well, I guess he's a hidden survivor. Kitty, your tail's whacking my mic. Uh. He's in the food court. And Dead Rising too. I think you. Oh. Hey, what you got? It looks like someone's searching the shelves at Chris's fine foods in the Palisades. Maybe he's seen some Zombrex. Maybe you're a whore. Oh, I hate when it's yellow. Hey, any leads? Giant clamshell in the Atlantica. I think she's stranded. Oh my. 
Yeah, it's gonna be a busy half hour. And again, she refused to take off her mermaid legs costume and just run. Guess she didn't want the zombies smelling her exposed cooch. Like, mmm, blood and meat. And again, how'd she get there? Ah, uh, that was frustrating. But I was recording like five minutes into the whole uh, playthrough or the whole poker match, just gonna not have, not keep the footage, just cut it. I'm like, wait, why am I doing this? So I just shut it off. And I got frustrated and killed everyone. Oh, I at least confirmed that this guy was here. Ah, I'm gonna hate this vehicle. Ah, see? Hard to control. And my stomach's been hurting the whole damn day. Here he is. This fuck sucker. Yeah, oh yeah, you need a gun. Ah! Excellent. You need a gun too when in Dead Rising 2, so. I usually had a handgun, but I guess I kept that shotgun on me for a reason. Oh, there's a bee there. Uh, that car is good for if you have one survivor with you. This is the part of the game where you gotta save a fuck ton of survivors. And there's a lot of hidden survivors, so... It's one of those hectic moments. Usually it's sort of in the middle towards the end. And of course he won't give- you can't give him any item. He won't drop his money case. Let's see where we going straight after this asshole. Not there. There, then, uh, then back to the Atlantic, huh? Then, uh, see that five or six, I can't tell. Hargity. <laughs> May need to make a shortcut back to the tape it or die team's place. See, I forgot this guy, so he's not in my, uh, my plans on how to save people. Don't even think I have time to go, uh, make the beer helmet. What you gonna give me there, asshole? Oh, buy some nice. Oh, 20? Well. Oh, that's nice, but I must be off. Racing against the clock here. And of course, I still gotta kill the rednecks. And once I save everybody, I'll go kill the rednecks. Although you have to do it in a specific order. Go ahead. Frank, there's someone trying to get into an ATM machine in the Shamrock Casino. I think he's trying to rob it. Bloody hell. Oh, yeah, that guy. Yeah, that guy, I'm gonna. Uh. Save last. In fact, I'm gonna save him after I've killed the rednecks. Oh, don't forget him. You know. Huh. And I gotta fight a boss. Most people probably know who it is. Dumbass redneck. Another dumbass redneck, so technically I'll be fighting five dumbass rednecks. With guns. And agendas. I'm going back to that food place. Chris is buying foods. Another reference back to Dead Rising 1. Ugh. I get reminded of the boss. The grocery store, that guy was awesome. This is my store! That's why I had the pineapple. Hope you like pineapple. 
This guy was in the, uh, the eatery outside in the Silver Strip in Dead Rising 2. I don't think you can give him, like, beer or anything. Now let's go save the mermaid. Then we need to go with these people way the fuck over there. Might want to take a different route, obviously. I thought I might as well kill the boss. Well, hard. Planning, planning, planning. Tape it or die, team that appears. At seven, so fuck. Okay, I'll, t I'll grab the mermaid. Take her to the safe room. And the fat fuck. Talk to tape it or die. Then I'll run over. Kill the redneck. Grab the survivor there. Uh, ah, shit. No, wait. Damn it. Okay, never mind. I'll... Fuck. Oh, okay, uh, let me think of this. Over. Drop off the survivors. Look at you, asshole. What's up? Grab some shit from Uranus land. Then talk to Tabor to die. Then go kill the redneck. Come on, Hick! Badass, whatever. You know what I was thinking. Uh, already at 12 minutes. I hate how their bar is digging down on the fuckers way back there, but priorities. I think once you talk to Tapered or Die, you don't have to be. come back all them automatically, but I like to be cautious. Gonna cut it close here. But that's why we like the challenge. Yeah, I like how money just transfers over. Makes it easy to get certain achievements. In fact, all you need is time. Oh. Oh shit, okay, get out, honey. Nearly a zombie there. <laughs> that was a matrix roll there, Frank. Oh, this is gonna be kinda close. In fact, I think I will just say fuck it. And, uh. Talk to tape it or die, then run, kill the hillbilly, grab the survivor, grab the people with the red bar there. Take him back. Back to the safe room. After I've grabbed certain things that I need for tape it or die. Need plates and a buzzsaw. Oh, I think I'm gonna save first, so. In case it fucks up. Never can be too cautious. That's my motto. And a whole bunch of other random things. Hmm. Red-headed mermaid. What that remind you of? Much oh, now she's standing. Got it. I think he gave his arm back, didn't he? Yeah. Where'd you get that money there, honey? 